Hello, everyone. Um, I would like to address a problem for all people. All people have this problem because the human heart is desperately wicked and deceitful. Who can know it? We find this out in the prophet Jeremiah. In 1 Kings, uh, our Jewish people read about Jezebel and they read about Ahab. They read about Elijah. And we learn that Jezebel was destroyed. She was destroyed because of greed. She was destroyed because of uh, lying and deceit. And then we have several hundred years later the coming of Moshiach ben Dovid, Yeshua HaMashiach. And he teaches, Matyahu, he teaches that what does it profit a man if he gains the whole world and he loses his soul? I've been engaged in wild monopoly games with uh, a young person and uh, we play these, this game over and over and over. He wins. I've never won, not once. He wipes me out entirely. But I asked him the other day when he was winning things, I said, D did you know that one of the Rockefellers died in a plane crash? They were very, very wealthy, we're wealthy people and did many good things. But what does it profit a man if he gains the whole world and loses his soul? And this particular Rockefeller died in a plane crash just recently. Terrible, terrible tragedy. And so I asked the little one, what would you do if you passed away that way? What would you do? Would you go before the Lord? Would you stand before Yeshua in heaven or the other place? And he said, I would go to him. Yes, I would. I would be with him. So I'm very grateful for his good confession. And I want to ask everyone to make the good confession. There is no way you can be free from the world, the flesh, and Hasatan. You cannot be free of the love of money, which is the root of all kinds of evil, unless you are putting your faith in the bank of heaven, in the king of heaven, Yeshua HaMashiach, Amen.